Yes, they told me your fault and I was not to listen to your fine words nor trust to your charity. You promised me my life, but you lied. You think that life is nothing but not being stone dead. It is not the bread and water I fear. I can live on bread. When have I asked more? It is no hardship for me. It is no hardship to water the want to be clean. Bread has no sorrow for me, watching no affliction. But to shut me from the light of the sky and the sight of the fields and flowers, to chain my feet so that I can never again ride the soldiers nor climb the hills, to make me free fall of all damp darkness, and to keep me from everything that brings me back to love of God when your wickedness and foolishness tempt me to hate him. All this is worse than a furnace in the Bible that was heated seven times. I could do without my war horse, I could drag about in a skirt, I could let the banners trumpets in the night and the souls pass me by and leave me behind as it leaves other women. If only I could still hear the wind in the trees, the logs in the sunshine, the young lambs crying through the happy frost and the blessed, blessed church bells that send my angel horses floating to me on the wind. But without these things I cannot live, and by your wanting to take them from me or from any other human creature, I know that your counsel is of the devil and that mine is of God.